Hey lovely people, welcome back to My Big Fat Tummy. Today I have come with another quick recipe of a fast food from Maharashtra as we all know about pav bhaji. I am going to show you this lip smacking recipe with some simple steps. Let's dive. First of all, in a pan I have taken 1 tablespoon of butter. Raise your hand if you are a butter lover. Butter delicious. <laughs> Butter has been melted completely. Now adding 4 small sized tomato which I have chopped into 4 equal halves. Adding half cup of peas. Giving a mix. Guys, you can add capsicum, cauliflower as well. As I don't have these at present so I didn't add. Adding boiled potato. Here I have taken two small sized potato which I have cooked in a pressure cooker. After adding this mix well with the other ingredients. So it's done. Now I am adding 1 tablespoon of salt. This must be as per your taste. Now again I am mixing this. Saute this for about 2-3 to three minutes. After doing so, I am adding half cup of water. Then again, mix this properly. Try to mix this very properly because this is very important process to make the bhaji. Now I am going to cook this for about 10 minutes. So I am covering this with a lid. After 10 minutes you can see that the bhaji has almost cooked and you can see the water has been absorbed properly now again mix this now with the help of a masher I am mashing the entire thing make sure all the peas have been mashed so it's done now let's add the dry ingredients Adding 1 teaspoon of red chili powder, 1 foot teaspoon of turmeric powder, 2 teaspoon of pav bhaji masala, 2 sliced green chili and some coriander leaves. Mix this properly. Now adding 1 teaspoon of kasuri methi. Then mix mix. Now I am making a place in the middle. Just keep the entire 
mixture on the side of the pan and make a just small space in the middle. Here I am adding 1 tablespoon of butter. Let it melt completely. Now I am adding 1 small sized chopped onion. Now adding half teaspoon of red chili powder, half teaspoon of kasuri methi, adding 1 tablespoon of ginger garlic paste, 1 teaspoon of pav bhaji masala. Now let's squeeze some lemon. Here I am using just half portion of a small sized lemon. So all my ingredients have been added. Let's mix this very very properly. Now based on your preference, add water. If you want this as thick consistency then add less water and if you want this as not so much thick then add more water. Simple as it is. You can see that I didn't put the entire water at a time because this is not possible for me to know that how much water the entire mix will absorb and how much not. So better to put some amount then after that based on your choice keep adding. That's it. So you can see that the bhaji has been cooked properly and I can feel the fragrance. Keeping this aside, now let's cook the pav. For this, I have added 1 teaspoon of butter in a pan or a tawa. Then adding just some amount of red chilli powder and some amount of pav bhaji masala. Now spread the entire masala. Now adding some freshly chopped coriander leaves and keep the flame low. So it's time to add the pow. Cooking for some seconds, I have flipped the pow. Cook the pow on the both side. So it's done. I can't wait to have a bite from here. Guys, please do let me know whether you are enjoying my work or not. If you want some interesting videos or if you want to recommend some other please do let me know in the comment section below for more such amazing and quick recipes do subscribe to my channel if you are new and yes if you want the daily updates please press the bell icon so that whenever I post any video a notification arrives to your inbox so thank you guys for staying with me and thank you guys for showering love to my videos and yes I owe you keep supporting me like this and please 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 thumbs up to my video yes obviously if you like it and if possible give a small comment about your experience if you have tried this one and yes if you are inspired from my videos don't forget to inform me I'm always there to reply to your comments so guys thank you for watching this thank you for your time take care love you and good night